Hello. I am going to show you how you can boost the FPS of any game. And make any heavy game run smooth in low budget PC. As you can see I am playing WWE 2K17. This is one of the most heaviest games. And you can also see how slow its FPS are. This game is running on ultra settings. And it's running on 10 to 15 FPS. I am going to boost the speed of this game. Using a software called Cheat Engine. And you can see this is the window of Cheat Engine. I am going to increase the speed of this game by 3% so type here 3 and click apply. And see the speed of this game has been increased. As you can see how easy and fast it is to use Cheat Engine. And not only WWE 2K17. But you can boost any game by this software. Like GTA 5. And many others. This software can run in any PC. And can boost FPS of any game. And now I am going to show you how you can use Cheat Engine. And how you can download it. First I will show you how you can install it in your PC. Now I am going to show you how to download Cheat Engine software. First of all open any browser. And type Cheat Engine ORG. And search. As you can see. It shows many sites. But open the first site. This is the official site of Cheat Engine. Click on this big green button. And then the downloading will start automatically. As you can see here. The downloading has been started. It's just of 3.2 megabytes. Downloading has been completed. Now we have to install the setup. Here is our setup. Now open it as administrator. Click on yes. And select English language and press OK. As you can see the installer is opened. Click next. Decline this. Or it's going to install any unuseful software with it. Now please wait here. Until it's download the required files. And install the Cheat Engine software. By this software you can boost the frame rates of any game. Now it's getting installed. Until you please like this video. And subscribe to my channel. This installation is not going to take more time. Now the installation is completed. Click on finish. And now it's going to ask for tutorial. Click on no. Because I am going to show you how to use it in the right. And the easiest way. And finally within 2 minutes we have downloaded and installed the Cheat Engine software. Now I will show you how to use it to boost FPS of your game. First of all open a game in the background. Just like I have opened GTA 5. Now I am going to show you the normal FPS of my GTA 5. If you want to download GTA 5 for free and the 100% working. For that I have already made a video. You will find the link of it in description. While using recorder my game is getting 40 to 45 FPS. And it's also getting lag in between. It's only because of the screen recorder. Now I will show you guys how to boost the FPS of the game by Cheat Engine software. First press the start button so it will minimize the game. So from there you have to open your Cheat Engine window. As I have opened. Now click on this red box on the top left corner. From there select GTA 5. Or any game which you have to boost. And press open. Now click on this enable speed hack option. And type there a number by what percent you have to increase the speed of your game. My FPS are good so I will increase the FPS by 2%. And then click apply. And start the game from task bar. As you can see the FPS of the game has been increased. And the game is working faster than before. My PC has a graphics card so it's running much faster on it. If in your PC GTA 5 or any other game lag so much you can do this method. This is very easy and fast, if you want your game normal again. 
you just close the cheat engine software from the background. It will make your game normal again. By this software your game will never lag or crash. And also it has no virus in it. Talk about the game. The game is running super smooth. Even the recording software is on. I was getting a request by my subscribers. That how to increase FPS of the game. On a PC without graphics card. So for them I made it. If you have any problem or question about it please comment me down. I will reply you within an hour. And also suggest me some new topics. On which I should make a video for you guys. Ok see you next time. Bye.